how to YouTube. I'm coming uh, at you with the deck profile, the Minerva deck, the Tur Minerva Turbo, whatever you want to call it. Uh, this is my favorite deck to play in the meta right now. I'm not super thrilled about what's coming out until February, but, uh, but this is what I'm playing at the upcoming regional, and so I'll, I'll dive right in. So for the Light Swarm Monsters, playing two Felice, playing three Wolf, playing two Lila, and three Raiden. So it's a Light Swarm deck, but you play Minerva. These are great for milling to get to your snow and kind of get your plays going. So that's it for the Light Swarms. And now for the starter cards, this is kind of, you want to start with at least one Light Swarm and, uh, and at least one of these cards. And I'll go with one Goblinberg, two Thrasher, two Goldfish. Now, I'm probably going to play another Goblinberg since I am playing the Synchro variant of this, but but uh, you want to start with one of these and one of these um, in your, your Golden. And then the, the next monsters that I'm playing are going to be two Hat Tricker and two Trick Clown, three Gigabyte, and the best card in the deck probably is Fairytale Snow. So this is a, a good way to kind of extend your plays. If you, after you get started, you can just normal summon a Snow, and then special summon Gigabyte, and then special summon um, Hat Tricker, and you're, you're going off. So that's it for those monsters. And I'm playing the Gigabytes because I want to be able to get out Toad. And so that's why I'm playing Gigabyte and the Tin Goldfish. And so I'm also playing for the Cinco part of it to Glow Up Bulb. This helps the Nat Beast play and the Trishal play. And it's just fun to have that engrave and be able to mill one to summon it. And then Broken Card to Mexi. And so for the spells, uh, these are the kind of the starter, again, the starter cards. You want to start at least with one of these, and that's three Solar Recharge, two Charge of Light Brigade, and three Instant Fusion. So this is kind of, I, I wish I was playing a 40 card deck, but it's really hard with this build to, to have 40 cards, but but I'm playing about 43. So these are kind of the rule of eight and 40, that if you're playing eight of one certain type of card, you're probably gonna start with it. So that's kind of, kind of playing off that rule a little bit, but the math is a little different. But this is, uh, these are great. You wanna start with one of these and it's and it's pretty pretty good golden. It gets your plays going. Helps you summon cards, helps you get cards in grave. So those are perfect. And then for just kind of extra cards to extend plays and situational plays is Twin Twister, Reinforcement of the Army, One Desires, One Foolish, One Soul Charge. So if you're going second, these are great. You're going against Paleozoic, Pendulum, these are great. Um, the Desires, I wish I played more, but I only have one, so that's, that's it for now. And Foolish Burial helps dump cards that you need to grave. And this card just wins. So now for the extra deck. Play one of uh, the baby girl, Minerva. She's beautiful. Uh, this is supposed to be my Bahamut Shark, but I can't find it in the bunch of bulk that I have. So this is Bahamut Shark and then Toad. So if you're playing and you have Instant Fusion, you have Gigabyte, you have 10 Goldfish, you can get to your to this play opening. So ideally, uh, there's, there's times where you can open with, with this. And if you do that, you have a one card advantage here with Omega, and then you have another Negation, and then you have Minerva, so it's a hard out for, for a lot of decks to get over all three of those. And especially if you have a Snow Engrave, that is very, very difficult. So then uh, I'm playing a Trapeze for the OTK plays. If they have a clear field and you are, have, so have some cards that you can attack for damage, this is really, really good, especially with Cyframe Omega pretty much floating all the time, that's very powerful. And so one Diagusto, one Castell, one Karagorgon. This is for well, when you're playing Pendulum. They don't have a lot of outs to anti-spell. So if they if they have anything, you can really really redirect them. If they try to, to Castell you, you can just say no. Uh, so that's that's kind of what that's for. And also for Paleozoic, it's there it's hard for them to attack over this, so it's it's good to be able to redirect. And then Utopia package. And then one Abyss Dweller, one Diamond Dyer. And that's it for XYZs. And for the the uh, Synchros, I'm playing one Omega. I probably will put this at two, but I don't have space right now. One Scarlight, because that's if they have a, a full board, you can you can uh, wipe it and then do damage and then be able to attack. And then Trishula. 
So a lot of people don't see this coming, but this is like mid-game, just kind of shutting the door. And then for Fusion, it's just one uh, Norden. That does it for the extra deck, and then let's go to side deck. So I have three anti-spell for the Pendulum, that's obvious. Three system down for the pesky ABC. This gay, this card just wins you the game. And you're opening at about 35% chance of starting with this. So first hand against ABC, especially if you win game one, this is this is solid. And then for Peleozoic, I'm playing three wiretap because I do not have Dinkos. But this is good to just negate and then shuffle back into the deck so they don't have material to go off. One Raigeki. And then two Psycho Reader. I have this for ABC and for for the uh, occasional blue eyes. And then one Nat Beast. I'm, this is for going second against pretty much a lot of any any spell card focused deck like Pendulum or, or e I mean even ABC it's not bad. Especially if you have a Snow Engrave against ABC. They, they're only out to this is gonna be Castell. And you can just Castell, uh, or you can just Perry Snow when they summon Castell and they have the material still on there and it's hard, hard for them to get out. So. So that's it for the deck profile. I'm Yo, what is up, guys? My name is Rolando, and I know I am not the same voice you're used to hearing. Uh, I am not Nathan. However, I am here doing this Red Eyes Tune deck profile for TCG Bros today.